welcome back you guys so we're back to our property here uh it's a little duplex we haven't really gotten over what happened with this property but we'll go ahead and start off today um just to take a look at it, it looks a little bit better than it did before still a little scuffs but overall i would say it's rent ready this property we got it on the market we got about july or june 2023 we actually almost didn't get this property the only reason we were able to get this property was because we did a trick that we weren't aware of is that we put more money to the earnest earnest money deposit we actually beat out people who are thirty forty thousand dollars over us because of this trick. So if you're thinking about buying a property think about adding more to the earnest they'll see you as a lot more of a serious investor come on in you guys now not sure if you guys remember if you guys saw the previous video if so I'm just going to take a look back there is another unit adjacent to this one when we got that property it had its headaches and it wasn't like this one this one had some mess but it wasn't like the other one that property there it had five pets now we had no pets allowed on the lease it had one bully dog you don't want a bully dog for insurance reasons look that up and it had four cats three baby cats and one big cat you don't want that in your property, especially with the carpets. Take a look at it. It was trashed. That unit was not great. This unit had its headaches. Not as bad as the other one. The previous tenant here did take care of it a lot better than the one over there. Now, with the other unit, we had broken windows. We had AC problems. We had AC problems here. We did just finish fixing up the HVAC in this unit. That, I think, is going to make it a little bit easier for us to go ahead and get this property rented. One of the lessons that we learned from the other unit, we had it looking great in a place that I would actually live in. But one thing we did not do, we didn't upgrade the HVAC system. That's a mistake, you guys. We've learned that. We had two units last year that after we got fixed up, oh my gosh, one of them took six months to get rented. This one, the adjacent one, took, I believe, three and a half. Just for point of reference, I listed a property up for rent two days ago. Within one day, I got it rented. Refrigerated AC in this desert climate makes a big difference. Take a look, you guys. Now, we did get lucky with this property. Just finding it. This is one of the few properties I got it at a 7% interest rate. Now, people say you can't really cash flow with 7%. For the most part, they're right. <laughs> but with this one, even going slightly above market, we got this place to cash flow. Just to go off of it, the mortgage on this place is about two grand a month. With this thing fixed up, with the new HVAC on this side, not on the other side yet, we will be cash flowing a little under $400 a month on this duplex. That's not a bad thing, seriously. Come on in. Not sure if you remember, but we got a new refrigerator. New to us, but definitely better than the previous one. I would say it's considerably better than it was before. Hope you guys are liking this. If you have questions, feel free to ask. I do have to warn you guys, though, I'm a newbie. I've only been doing this for a couple of years. Let's go take a look at the outside, you guys. We bought this property, like I said, June, July of last year. The good thing is in equity, I've already gone up $20,000 on this thing. I'll take that as a win, but mainly I'm just happy to have it. I am assuming the next couple of years, this property and our other properties are going to go up quite a bit if we do end up getting that decrease in interest rates. Don't know if it will happen, you guys, but if it does, we're set to win. I hope you guys had a good time taking a look at this property. Hopefully you guys will enjoy the next one. Like and subscribe. Have a great day.